Okay, here we are inside. Somebody's already pulled the fire alarm. And you go upstairs there. Oh, boiler room. Looks like a pristine hot water heater. It looks fairly small for a place like this. I know this place has been boarded up and abandoned for a while. Well, it hasn't been boarded up for a while, but it has been abandoned for a while. I don't have any full history on it, so I will look that up and see if I can find anything to put in the description below. Because the boards haven't been on for that long, I just have a regular respirator on today. Plus, some, not all the windows are boarded, so... It's been a lot of vandalism. You can see all the smashed glass everywhere. Emergency code. Oh, there's the old PA systems. See? They just went nuts on this place. And there's big shards of glass everywhere. It's just the resource center. Nothing left in here. Looks like a gym. Oh, here's a gym. Oh, this is like a stage here. That's pretty cool. And that light you see there is where the front door would have been, or the side door. But I think it's really the front. East, west, stage and kitchen. Let's go back where we came from. Now this is entering the gym this way. Okay, I've already seen it. Oh, something stuck on my foot. Just one of the classrooms. Huge pane of glass there. You gotta be careful where you're walking. Bathroom. Yeah, wash your hands, kitties. And 
Fire alarm panel information do not remove. Emergency switches. Family, friends, Easter, hospital, food science, hard read, medium read, simple read. Colors and shapes, Thanksgiving, Halloween. Kind of similar to the other side. And in here, visual discrimination, classification, math, alphabet games, almost like um, kindergarten maybe. Farm animals. Her EpiPen. Here is the main entrance that I was talking about. And that's looking into this side of the gym. Whoa, look. The vandals have knocked the glass out of everything in here. Can't get up that stairway, but I know one back there we can. I haven't been in here yet, so I might find another one. Every bit of crunching you hear under my feet is glass. That's about the only debris on the floor. I'm moving up to another level here. That's the front of the building, but I don't think it's the main entrance. As you can see, the doors aren't as wide. And this, hold on a second. It's locked. Sorry. It's funny, they always have to remind people to wash their hands, which is a good thing. But it's pretty bad that you have to remind people these days. It looks like some water has got in through the window there that's open. Look at that. Unbelievable. So this is the staff room. Okay, some little tiny health room here. Office. Very small room, whole little bathroom. Flu fighter. There's a um, toilet in behind there. And some flooding. Huh. I don't know where it's coming from because the ceiling seems fine.
and the hall goes that way. And just a classroom. Oh, just Hagers. Just wanted to get an idea of what they taught in here, but it looks like they erased all the old information. Hmm. Let's go down this hallway. Probably another bathroom. Yeah, just bathroom stalls. And more, I guess. One for male, one for female. This would be the female one, likely. <laughs> Obviously. Oh, look at the cute little water fountains. All the little code hooks with the names. Looking out the front. Kind of something here. It's another room with code hooks. These basically all look the same. Do I even need it? Yeah. I wasn't sure if I needed my flashlight or not. Another room. Well, it's just an office room there, administration. Or maybe maintenance or janitorial. That's too bad all the desks are gone. I wish I had more information on it right now so I can narrate it to you. But I just stumbled upon it, so... Lots of bathrooms. You know what, I was going to come back to this, but since we're here, I probably won't find it again, so let's do it now. Oh my god. Wow, it's like... Toilet is smashed all over the um, stairs here. Okay. It might be a little unstable, a little shaky. Uh, <laughs> huh. That's not really a basement. Ooh, look at that. That's ominous. It's like one room here. 
So those stairs just came to one room. Those are just letters and numbers on the floor. I think, hold on. Multiplication facts. Let's go in here. This looks really creepy. <laughs> okay, it ends. Thought it was gonna be like tunnels. Okay, let's go back up and we'll find the upstairs. Okay, here is the upstairs. And it doesn't look like they have anything boarded up here, so I can probably turn my flashlight off for most of it. One sec, guys, I'm going to put my flashlight away. Okay, here we are at the top of the stairs. More little coat hooks with the names on it. Still left some of them. Anyway. It's much nicer when you don't have to use a flashlight too. Oh, the drapes have all been ripped off the windows. It's like sinks in almost every classroom. Now what purpose would they get out of ripping those off the windows? Makes you wonder. I just failed to see the thrill. Oh, look at that. Even had to destroy that little fountain. Lots of plastic here as well. Oh, just a bathroom. Girls. Okay, that's different. I, I remember those. Kind of brings you back. Oh, the vandals are definitely going to have a lot of years of bad luck. I'm surprised the toilets are still intact. I'm sure they're not through with this place. Lighting panel. Huh. And boys. Oh, they forgot this mirror. Just two urinals and one stall. Don't need my flashlight now. More drapes on the ground. Looks like dead bodies. Looks like casualties all over the floor. Lots of profanity.
and that goes back down. Well, there's more to the upstairs than just this area. Supplies. You can see this looks up to the roof. But, um, maybe not. Well, let's see where this goes. It's kind of cool how they have all the murals on the walls there. Oh, this just brings you out to where the gym is and the front main area. And these doors are heavily chained on the other side. And we've already gone down that hall, so that's what that roof was covering. And that entrance as well. Just on my way out, I realized I missed one room on this side of the hall. Not much to it though. Just more casualty drapes on the ground. Moving to Arthur Ford room, number question mark. Okay, thanks for exploring with me, guys. I'm going to try to find my way out of here, and I think this is the direction. Take care.